what is Lizzie from Lizzie's World of Gems. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing the post review on my crumbly. It's done guys. What do you think? Super excited. I worked on it all day Friday to finish it, to get it done. It's Saturday morning. I had to finish one last section up here and I am done. And I think it looks amazing. Um, for, um, if you're new to diamond painting and you want to learn more about diamond painting, I really recommend this book. It's Diamond Painting Guide and Logbook. It is, um, the author is Jennifer Roberts, which is a YouTuber on, um, a YouTuber on YouTube. A YouTuber on YouTube. Oh, I, I can't even speak this morning. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get this video up before my uh, granddaughter comes over for a visit so um, she has in the back a log book about um, diamond painting log sheet so I'm gonna go on the post review part on the star rating so how can I do this so I can see it I'll just hold it in my hand because you guys can't see my hands yeah 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 so on the post review part of her log book she has canvas glue completely sticky, slippery, rivers, bubbles, etc. Um, I had none of that. Maybe a little bit of slippery in a couple of places, but not too bad. Um, I've had other canvases that were poor glue that were a little bit more slippery. Once you get poor glue, you tend, some paintings tend to, the gems tend to slide, but this one was pretty good. Um, simple clarity. Now that is the only issue I've had on this canvas, but um, take note that this is an old canvas from Craftably. They have upgraded and the quality of their new canvases are 100% uh, more better as far as I can see from my unboxing. I have two unboxings from um, last week and the week before were both Craftably, so check it out. Um, their clarity of their canvases are a lot better. But as you can see, I still completed the painting, even though I had a little bit of issues with some symbols, because you know Liz was as determined to finish a project, and I did, and I am so happy I did, because look at it, it looks beautiful. Um, drill quality, um, did I run out? Um, no i did not even though i kind of felt like i was going to on some of the colors but really it was just me being paranoid i have plenty plenty left over i really like that their stickers are big and bold and they fit on my on my um harbor freights really good um harbor freights you can only order from the u.s they're only for u.s residents if you live internationally you have to get a friend from the u.s to either ship them to you and buy them off of them or get a family member that lives in the US to go to Harper Freight and buy you some of these. These are my favorite containers by far. And I got quite a few because I have uh, a friend of mine on YouTube sent me a lot. Uh, Jennifer Roberts sent me one, Billy sent me a few, and uh, my cousin sent me a few. So that's how I got all my Harper Freights. Um, yeah i really love the drill quality of um these drills i have nothing to complain about these drills there's no popping drills their quality of drills by far is a uh, good very good quality i am very impressed um they're one of the top top three for the drills um I'm not like I did um, pretty neat creative and their drills I I compare their drills to as good as pretty neat creative very 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 good very good drills um, design suggestions the only thing I suggest that is the canvas didn't have blurry symbols um, but like I said their new canvases are made like they totally feel different they're velvet on the back it looks like it's coming from a new company. I don't even know for sure because it's not like I talk to them to so know, but it doesn't look like 
the quality of this one. It's um, very much improved. And my experience overall, other than I was having a hard time seeing the symbols, I fairly enjoy doing this piece. Um, it was a lot of um, confetti, and sometimes I think I put things in the wrong spots, but I don't even know. <laughs> but I managed to figure out what that symbol was. It was the only, it was only the, the only symbol that I hadn't used. Um, there's a little bit of gapping here in the white. You can see a little bit of gapping, but it's not noticeable unless you're looking at it up close. You might notice it a little bit on the on the camera, but I only notice it on the white. I don't notice it on the other colors. But um, I really, really enjoy this. I put their washi tape around it. It doesn't. It wasn't sticking very well. But you know what? It might have been because um, I put it on post, like after the fact, because it did get a little bit dirty here. And Alyssa spilled something there on it, my canvas. Yeah. Yeah, we're not going to talk about that. But um, it might be because of that. But I really like it that they send washi tape with it now. Just keep on pressing it until it stays down. It might be because this canvas has gotten dirty from, I should have put on washi tape when I first started, but I didn't think I'd have to, but I could see a little bit of dirt here and I didn't like it. So that's why I put the washi tape around. So I could show you my post review. But yeah, like I said, this is the uh, War Indian War Horse from Craftably. I'll have the artist I can't, I have it covered right now, so I can't read it. I'll have the artist in the description of the title of the video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's very, very short and sweet, but I just wanted to get it out so you guys can see my finished project. I'll probably have it on Manic Monday as well. But like I said, if you're new to diamond painting and you just stumble on my on my video and you like to subscribe hit that subscribe button that would be super super awesome i'd be tickle pink of course you'll hear that at the end of the video like i always do but this book if you want to learn how to diamond paint i suggest you buy it it's from rocky nook and i will link that down below as well so you guys can check it out with that said hope you guys enjoy this video i hope you guys like my war horse and i got another finish for 2021 yay this is my second one and i am going to do another craftably this year with a new canvas so we can check out and see how they have improved which i think they have i'm so excited to do that girl with the cat crazy cat chloe i really want to do that one so a look for that in the future. Till next time, take care everyone. Bye. Well, folks, that's it for today's video. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up. And if you like, please subscribe to my channel. I be super tickle pink. And remember to hit that notification bell and it will remind you whenever I load up a video. And till next time, take care everyone. Bye.